Yeah, taking a picture of three pens, that reminded me of something. You know when I stole all the pens on the ward in that hospital up uh, Johnstown? And they had to come to me like, Dylan, can we have a pen back, please? And I've got a handful of them. Like, yeah, sure, which one do you want? And uh, <laughs> this one and... Uh... Yeah, taking a picture of three pens, that reminded me of something. You know when I stole all the pens on the ward in that hospital up uh, Johnstown? And they had to come to me like, Dylan, can we have a pen back, please? And I've got a handful of them. Like, yeah, sure, which one do you want? And uh, <laughs> this one and... Uh... Okay, that's saved. I need a marker for where it is. So it's uh, between the hands and the pens. I could write that down, but um, with one of my pens, but I'll just record it. And, uh, uh, you know, what? Uh, oh, a truck just went boop boop with its horn around the corner somewhere, and then that it reminded me when, when you hear all the loud cars at night somewhere, like, and I'm like, I don't know what you're doing out there, but it sounds like fun. <laughs> Okay, and this is uh, Dylan reading from the book of Matthew, um, Mark 14. Uh, walk with God, uh, welcome him a new journey. In this 15, okay, we know all that, I'll just click on Mark 14 and read it. After two days was the feast of the Passover, and of unleashed bread, no, sorry, Unleavened, unleavened. I uh, see. I don't know what that means, but you get the idea. In it, I'm not going to record me doing it all because the phone won't be able to take it. But uh, maybe it puts me off a bit when I'm recording it, or maybe too many recordings makes things not as good. I don't. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to stop recording and try and read Mark 14 from the Book of Matthew. Okay, and, and we'll see how that goes. And and being in in Bethany in. And being in Bethany in the house of Simon and Leopard, I sat at meat. There came a woman with lovely big bouncing breasts. No, not really, but obviously you know that. <laughs> okay, okay, she had an owl buster box of omeyants or whatever. You know, and is that a polite way of saying a big pair of bouncy breasts? I don't know. Ah, uh, well. Came a woman having an owl buster box of omeyants of sparkened very preciously. Oh, she's got a lovely big pair of boobs that spunk all over them preciously and uh fuck it anyway sorry um and they murmured against her what's that something you do in a brothel what did you do in a brothel oh i murmured against her and jesus said let her alone why thee trouble her she has a lovely big bosom and they're mine and uh oh yeah she have worker for good work upon me Oh right, she's given him a yoke blow in the past. Oh cool. And, uh, yeah, go to the place and follow the man with a pitcher of the uh, water and uh, say to uh, and it says to him, the master saith, where is the gachamba? <laughs> where was he sending him to a brothel? But anyway, where's the gachamba? So whatever it's called. <laughs> oh fucking anyway. The That's a new word for boobs, isn't it? The questionbers. Ah, uh, where are the questionbers? Anyway. The Oh, have you seen the quest chumbers on that one? <laughs> uh, stuff like that. In the middle. Well, he did hang around with prostitutes, but you know, uh, it's possibly something I've heard. Uh, mm. Right, where were the quick chumbers? I want to see the quick chumbers, and uh, anyway, never mind. Um, something about brothels and prostitutes, and. Uh, and in the evening, he come off with the twelfth. So they all came over her. Hey, well, look, this is my interpretation, and it is a very loose one, but, you know. Um, so Jesus is like, one of you is going to betray me, and that one that betrays me, you're going to wish you were never fucking born. And uh, I could read the verse to see if it makes sense to you. And the son of man indeed goeth, as it is written of him, but woe to the man by whom the Son of Man is betrayed. Good were it for that man if he had never been born. Mm, yeah, see, I was right, you know, to a certain extent, possibly. Mm. Where is that? Where is that? Uh, uh, late junk, so, so, oh, fruit of wine. 
Drink the Lord of Kingdom. And when they had sung a hymn, Oh, Jesus is wonderful. We love you, God. I'm not taking the piss out of them. That's what they do. Um, he spoke more verently, possibly. I'm telling you now, you son of a bitch. Anyway. Um, and uh, smote a servant of high priest and cut off his hair. Stuck in the middle with you. And chopper. Read. They hold the peace and answer nothing. Um, uh, Jesus said, Answer of thou this, nothing. What is it the thou witnesses say against me? And he's like, I didn't cut no one's ear off. You can't prove it. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, she looked upon him and say, And thou also what's the Jesus of Nazareth? But he denied, saying, That's not my name. I say nothing. Nice. No, but he denied, saying, I know not. Neither understand I what thou sayest. I don't know what about it. It's enough to do with me, man. And he went out into the porch and the cock crew. Mm. Cock doodle doo, motherfuckers. Ah, oh, shit, whoops. And that, oh, phew. And that was Mark 14 from the book of Matthew, read and loosely tra translated by Dylan Martin Riley. Can we hear your audio recording still? Well, there's some slight complications there. The phone connects to the little smart TV. Cool. The phone needs charging. Cool. It's overheating. Cool. When it's connected to the smart TV and it's doing that, it's overheating even more. So, not so cool, but I'll see what I can do in a bit, okay? Show me the quachumbas. I think everyone knows that was my sense of humour, right? Yes, yeah, still, because it was funny as fuck. Alright, cool, just wanted to double check. And... Uh, going up shop for Robbie. I might just have to buy a patch of tobacco, it's a need and a must. And, uh... Hmm. Go and buy the office and that, and they're making up their fucking gibberish about us. Anything you can write, I can write better. And, uh, anyway, uh, yeah. At least God can, right? And, uh, ooh. You call that rain? That's barely missed. Hey, hey, well, you know. A two hit a cone piece. Fuck me, you'll have to draw me a picture of that for me to know what that is. Nah, it's all good, isn't it? But, uh, it's, just, uh, it's, uh, it's better than all good. It's not better than all good. These people say that and it means this and that and that. It's all good, the man. Alright, oh, what can I do? I've got a bit of coffee left. I've got a cigarette rolled. Um, I could roll a little Dacker Spiff, or I could check how many shekels are left in the coin purse, or whatever they used to call it back then. Hmm. Uh, right, let me see. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten succulent pounds and ten pence. Hmm. Ah. Uh. Dear Lord, our Heavenly Father, I would just like to thank you from the bottom of my heart for this, that and the other and some other things. Thank you. Amen. I think they were singing it to me, but you with your legal friends in your legal ends or whatever they're saying, ain't it? But, you know, um, well, maybe it was then, maybe it was me. I sort of heard it at the same time it was said and all that, but uh, well, to a certain extent. Uh, something about a little bit of an ache, but it's probably nothing. And uh, put the coffee down and step away from the cigarettes. Yeah, all right, this is me we're talking about. Oh, texting Luke, so on and so forth. You can slow it down and read it, but sound sound as my bro. We'll see you tomorrow now. And may Jesus' blessings be upon you, as they are me. Amen. And uh, my God, bro, I feel that. Amen. Hallelujah, another one saved. Um, but I don't know what to reply to him. I could just say hallelujah. But um, hmm. Okay, so, okay. Hallelujah meaning. It's pronounced hallelujah, but we all know that, right? But um, hallelujah meaning. Dictionary definition from Oxford Languages, Lamb, more exclamation. 
God be praised, uttered in worship or as an expression of rejoice, noun, an utterance of the word hallelujah, or hallelujah, if you prefer, as an expression of worship or rejoice. We all know that now, don't we? And uh, hey, thanks to God and uh, stuff. Hey. Uh, I don't know if I've got enough data to check the, what the uh, black and red one with the raccoon's been up to, but she's posted a video. And there's that Chelsea one from earlier, but I didn't even get round to checking what it was. But And, uh, uh well, um, as I've probably got enough uh, gigabytes. I've got about 3.5 to look at one video, right? Let's have a look now. Where's the rest of your black and red, and where's the raccoon? Ah, oh, well, anyway, I think, yeah, people get my humour right, for the most part. Um, anyway, uh. It's Lamar, and he's all balaclavered up like the RA to say a prayer, yes, bro? Well, you could say the Illuminati, they wear suits and balaclavas too, but, you know, some of us know that by now, right? Um... I know, I know he's saying this, that and the other and maybe he's trying to inspire me to stop smoking weed and that but I'm about to roll a little Dacker Smith now and you know, God's set my life up as it is and I'm the one saving people now like my, my, like my bro Luke in it, you know and whoever else has been saved by starting to believe or you know, I, 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 I don't know all these and about it's a bit common look, I, I've got them hazel eyes, right, in brackets and uh, whatever else is going on in my life uh, Anyway, I'll, I'll play the uh, audio recording in a minute now, yeah? Possibly. Um, hmm. One thing at a time, man. I just gave up special brews the other week. Oh, like, hey, well... <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, we all going on about, oh, you sons of bitches. Wait until I find out who's behind this. I'm going to have a murder and that. Now. <laughs> you know, for... Um, hmm. Yeah, uh, you know. Maybe it's just my sense of humour. Uh, this is called Four Pictures of Three Pens by me, Dylan Martin Riley, and uh, made with the help of our Heavenly Father, somehow. You fucking, you fucking son of a bitch with your son of a bitch car driving past. I can't hear my audio recordings while I'm smoking my daca spliff at the window. Show some fucking approach, what's the word, um... <laughs> I'm not being a million percent serious, but you can see how that could be ever so slightly annoying. Ah. Yeah, sorry, that, uh, sorry, that could have been Alex's mum for all I know, so, um, that, don't take that too much to heart, it's just, God, it look like Alex's mum's, but, uh, you know. I'll just bring the speaker over to the window, and if you can't hear it through the phone, that's too bad. But maybe the speaker's bugged too, who knows, right? And, uh, <laughs> mm. yeah. Yes, yeah, some other people have that information too. Don't stay in the mucky pond, go for a walk. But it doesn't just apply to me, that's a lot of other people too, that their uh, environment is designed to make them unwell, and, uh, you know. Me, 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 right? And, uh, okay, anyway. That was sarcasm going on about me, there's other people too, but, you know. I just saved one of them earlier, Luke, he's like, no, nah, they turned all my back on me, the angels and this and that, ever, and I'm like, nah, bro, like, like, God's put you in my life, and, and he's put me in your life, you know, and, uh, I'm glad he did, and you know, and that applies to other people in my circle as well, and you know, and uh, <clears throat> uh, so you know, but um, that was a bit off the beginning point, and I can't even remember what that was, but at least it was recorded, right? And uh, oh, great, now I'm reminding myself that I can have another cigarette, and I want one. And, uh, well, worst problems to have at sea, obviously. Um, When I, when I done that, um, when I see you smile, to that old beat, and then it's like, uh, 
whoa, it's a bit of a headache, and then, uh, well, at least you could use it to torture people like that mainstream stuff, you know, and, uh, look, 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 hang on a minute, stop, wait a minute, wait, 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 look, 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 no, hold on, oh, it's nothing important, I've just got to go and get a jug of water for my squash. Uh, so someone's in a happy door slamming mood, like Rachel, and uh, have I said something to offend the dark, whilst talking my light into the world? Um, but you know, the, the staff are always doing that anyway, it's part of their game. We all know that, right? Yeah, yeah, hang on, we'll get back to that door, but let's just play the last clip. Yeah, because something must have hit a nerve or something, or maybe somebody got saved for some reason, you know, that didn't believe in all that stuff. And is, that a, is that a bad thing for the dark? For people to come into the light? Oh, the mind boggles. The complete sane crazy guy with the light truth, he would be proud. Almost sort of see him happy as he was listening. And uh, I hope that makes sense to find in you. It was, uh, you know, it's not a million percent accurate description, you know. Uh, the light, Peter. Come into the light. Get out of the dark. Come into the light, Peter. <laughs> free back from the two pens. Okay, the two pens is the mark I is free videos back in case you need that information. It can also be the name of the next audio recording, which is the recording after the last recording, and then, and then after the next recording, um, which is currently playing now. And if it is playing now, that means I've got round to it. Alright, cool. Thank the Lord for everything, even the pain you've been through. Been through means you've been through, so you could be coming through the other side, you know. What do I know about pain, right? A various different, different types. Why do you, why do you need to thank him for the pain, Dale? Because oh look, I'm just someone that's gone through life and everything's been wonderful, and I know nothing about the world, so you can thank him for the pain. But you know, thank him for everything else in between, obviously. But I think I've already gone over that. Um, uh, there is more to it than that. Than that, there's old sayings: "What doesn't kill you makes you stronger," and there's there's other things as well. Um, I, people could probably think about it or talk about it more if they wanted to um, how pain and suffering can be a good thing eventually or you know oh look they're real fucking successful with their gold medal and their trophy on the fucking Olympics but you don't know the fucking pain and fucking broken glass and fucking cactuses they had to walk through to get up to the podium to have the fucking gold medal and the fucking cup do you know what I mean success and pain and well, like I said, other people can think about it more if they want and try and come up with ideas why you need to thank God even for the pain you've been through. Um, but, you know, these are just my opinions and thoughts on it, so, you know, take it as you like. Sometimes you have to lose the plot before you can find it, you know. And uh, that does bring me to a little story, if I may. Of course you can do what they say, but... Um, so that rave that was sort of in between Finsbury and Holloway, uh, where's it to you now? Some sort of old college and, you know, my dad and me go in there as you do and there's a guy on the keyboard in the room. Maybe that was a fucking movie film too. Anyway, he left me in a fucking a little side room while he went off to do something. And, uh, like, you know, there was some fax paper. I was like, oh, I could take some of that for some reason. And you know them spinny things where you look through the slit? You spin it and you look through, yeah, and there's uh, something happening, and uh, I'm doing it, and there's like a fucking horse going around the racetrack and jumping over the hurdles and stuff, and I'm spinning it, spinning it, and looking in it, and, and, I, and then I'm thinking, oh, I wonder if I need that fax paper. But anyway, and then um, there's more to the story. Um, and then anyway, John come back, and then uh, we've gone into one of, what do you call them, where you sit, there's a professor and lots of chairs, and you listen to him and write stuff down. Um, there's a guy in there with a, I think he was bald, like, my dad knew him, so he's probably, you know, well, he's, he sound as fuck, obviously, but my dad knew him, and uh, the fucking keyboard, like, and he's like, um, 
you know, he's the, he's the keyboard guy and he's like trying to teach me some things and I learned that thing where you press the two keys and move it along, remember? I was at that fucking rave thing, like you go in, there's all strobe lights and piled up bottles of water and you know, all that shit and there's me and my dad, you know, John Penn Dragon, the hippie with the dreads and his hold all. And you know, that's about all I've got for that story for now. Rainbow Church, was it? Rainbow Circle and... I don't know what the one by the theatre, uh, the, the theatre, old theatre in Camden is about, but you know, went there with my dad too once, and uh, so uh, you know, and uh, um, yeah, and uh, okay, I'm gonna leave that chapter there for now. I could. I could tell you I could tell you more about the rainbow church from me and my clis sister climbing all the ladders up the steeple to the top or taking the money out of the fucking charity jar to go and buy a blue bounty I'm not supposed to have across the road and a stamp on your hand and coming back and stuff but you know or how you could uh, go up to the top floor and you sort of go around and then at the back there was a double bed set up um, or you know how I, I sometimes you had some people playing drums and whatever but um, sometimes you, well not sometimes, but there was a big uh, stereo system set up on where the uh, God is your saviour and he is the one that's going to set you free. You know them places, um, what they, where the guy will be standing? There's a big rave set up there with the, the sound system and the decks and shit. And sometimes there'd be fucking strobe lights going and fucking screens with fucking trippy scenes on them and fucking people parting it up. You know, <laughs> you know that, that's just some of my memories from it, but... Uh, Rainbow Church, was it? Maybe some of uh, my dad's friends in the Rainbow Circle know. Um, George or John, you know, or you know, uh, people like that. Um. Going on about stealing things and leading by example, we're at the group, uh, you know, where we sit at the table and the rest, and the cameras are in the smoke alarms. Uh, they mind our phones in our pockets, but. Um, so what was the fucking thing? Oh yeah, I'm looking at the table of leaflets and stuff by the door and I pick up the New Testament or whatever the little book was and I'm like, uh, well, I could put it in my pocket but I don't think I should. Um, and I put it down and it's like, Tony's got pops up and he's like, oh, you can have it if you want. I was like, oh, I can't steal it. I was like, can I? I was like, I can't steal it, can I? He said, oh, you can have it if you want. Like, there's some, something along that line, so. Oh, I couldn't even steal a Bible, see? Talking about stealing things. Um, I swear I just see Trump in my head on his head on his knees saying a prayer, and I can't. Um, so he he was thinking to pray for me, dear Lord, um, please help Dylan, and he wasn't sure what to say. I think and then I helped him with it and said to be happy and content in life, and Amen. He said and he said it and said Amen, and um, I was like, oh, thanks, Trump, and he was like, it's all right, you help me do it. And, or something, but that's what I see in my head. So you know, there is people that believe in being able to see things 100 million miles away. Do you know what I mean? If it's that important, um, or you could look into things like that if you wanted. But um, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, still he goes. And, uh, that's the usual. One. It's called remote viewing, Dill. Oh yeah, but people think I'm just fucking out of my tree and you know whatever else is going on, right? But you know, so. Maybe there's some people listening that can look in to see whether that happened or not, or, you know. Um, yeah, okay, cool. Mr. Playing, uh, fucking basketball with God in the universe, but, you know. Eh, uh, well, you know. Um. That's probably just all my imagination too, right? I mean, uh, who knows? The people with the hazel eyes can fucking talk to God. They can see the future. They can this, that, and the other, and, you know. Um, but, you know. Take her word for it, not mine. My friends. I don't know the ins and outs of it. Was I not supposed to chuck what you're saying? Was I not supposed to chuck it back? Was he chucking me the universe? Then there's me using my mind to catch it and fucking then I, I push it, throw it back to him as as I can and he's like, well, no, because it was spinning it on his finger and stuff. So no, I, um, um, you know, and. Uh, uh, but then he threw it to me the last time I threw it back to him it was like, I don't know, it was like, yeah, I don't know, it's all good. That was the other week though, I know, I know, but I'm just refreshing people and my own memories. 
Yeah, no, nah, like, and then, like, all right, we're listening, trying to listen to this, but uh, so we're thinking in our minds whether it's Nick from Johnstown or fucking whoever else, the other guy. We're talking, and then it's like, let's did that. The last thought was sort of that song I made in it when it was like, that's the pretty bitch lady that showed me the stuff. Do them pretty bitch things you do for me. And get ready on the left, get ready on the right. And, uh, and the next point was, hmm. Oh, right. These flies are up a warning about the porn. I've got to stop doing all this porn. All right, one more, one more time won't hurt. Oh yeah, that's the pretty bitch lady that made me blow my load all over the stuff. <laughs> Not the, that was the thoughts that was going on while the, the previous one of the previous videos was playing. But you know, oh hey, well, maybe you can. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not a problem for me to say it, but it's not a problem. You shouldn't have a problem with it either. It's just part of the past, isn't it? You know, it's probably funny as fuck to some people. It might be a little bit funny to them now. I don't know. <laughs> All right, can we hear it back, please, though? So they want to hear the last one back, and uh, you know, because it's sort of it was said, but then it's gone in it sometimes. But you not know, when you make audio recordings, so you know. <laughs> Mm. So, yeah, four pictures of three pens, please. Um, right, cool. Um, yeah, and so on and so forth. Well, you got the <coughs> multicolored pen, George, give me. You got the Havel pen, click, and you got the green barrel. But uh, that's enough describing the four pictures of three pens. I mean, alright, so getting back to playing the one I'm playing, which is an hour and 15 minutes, uh, and then there's another one to make after that, I guess about 40 videos, and I know it's not all hallelujah and Jesus loves you, but maybe that is how it's supposed to be. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and that reminds me, uh, fucking, yeah, charging my phone, and I'm like, oh, it's not in the green, it's 99% charged, but I should leave it to go to 100, but that reminded me of Shays, whoever it was, going, oh, you're supposed to, le you're supposed to fully leave it fully charged and charge it when it's, but I'm not, and so, but anyway, yeah, like, what the fuck did you do that for? Oh, what's she doing? And fucking slipping into a coma or some shit while I'm falling asleep. Yeah, I can't move, can you nudge me? And I was back, you know, but, uh, I'm still standing in the hanging in the in the Can you play that back please Dill? Hey well there's a possibility you'll get to, uh, f you, you, you <laughs> there's a possibility you might get to hear it in the future, but um been through some stuff like that, have you? Oh, good, well done. That was some sarcasm with people that haven't been through some similar sort of situations, but 2020, and uh, yeah, that's the time apparently, and it also means other things, but maybe some other people can look into that right now. And uh, There was something about there was something about the recruitment centre and by there, and it's like shouting and stuff around the corner, maybe it's fucking bang, 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 Bill, about I'll join the fucking army to fucking get away from her with my fucking fully legitimate CV with when I've got no qualifications and oh well that's quite impressive All right, can I join you now then? Ah oh, well you know the rest in it but yeah these new new windows are great by the way Mr. Wide Boy that fucking triple glazing is fucking amazing <laughs> uh. did you detect any sarcasm in that? you Mr. Wide Boy with your windows that fell off a van. <laughs> Did you detect any sarcasm in that? You, Mr. Wise, what is he called? Okay, you, Mr. Wide Boy, with your windows that might fell off the back of a van. Bad triple glazing. <laughs> uh, not forgetting that the Muslims and the Christians believe in angels. Uh, you know, based on that thing I googled and text myself, um, myself in brackets, but you know. Oh, anyway, okay, Google. Okay, so Google's trying to talk to me. That's cool. So on and so forth. Uh, you can do this. You can do that. You can take us. Ask it to take a selfie. Her to take a selfie. 
you can uh, ask her to translate good evening um, from English to Italian. I thought, okay, we need to stop the audio recording, remember, and I didn't try and do that, but no, it's alright, I'll just press the button anyway, see what happens, and uh, okay, that's, that's, uh, <sighs> but, um, yeah, so, uh, basically, good evening in uh, Italian is buonasera, buonasera, everybody, <laughs> But okay, I'm gonna get back to learning a bit with Google. Just a little bit for now, please, Google. Okay, cool, yeah. And uh, I done the thing. And die. And die. She doesn't want. Me. Okay, okay. Okay. Right, I thought it's been helpful. So that's uh. So I uh, I learned. And then I said that da da and it's okay, okay. So I don't know, and then, uh, so, uh, what did I say? Alright, I'll try another one. Um. Mi chiedo se ho nuovi amici in Italia. Mi chiedo se ho qualche amico in Colombia. Mi chiedo se ho qualche amico in America. Mi chiedo se ho altri amici nel resto del mondo. Mamma mia, ai ai ai. Beautiful. Hello beautiful Google. I don't know what else I could say in Italian now. Um, uh, ah, can I say some rude things? Should I come back up? Okay. Voglio che tu mi succhi. Hai un bel paio di tette grandi. Per il resto delle tue parole, nessuna parola può descriverlo. Um, what else could I ask it now? Uh, if anything, uh, um, how do you say, uh, okay. Non ho alcuna leva per tutto ciò che fai nella mia vita. Ok, if you ever want to use this again, just say, be my Italian interpreter. Alright, cool, that's wicked. Thank you very much, Google. I really appreciate you uh, reaching out to me and making that happen. I was involved, but you know, it's always good, probably. Uh, Google teaching me, uh, showing me the thing, talk Italian, so on and so forth. Yeah, so it's like, uh, I wonder if I have any friends in Italy. I wonder if I have any friends in Colombia. I wonder if I have any friends in America. I wonder if I have any friends in the rest of the world. And then, and then I said a couple of rude things, you know. Well, they're not rude, you know, but. Oh, you have a lovely big pair of boobs, and fucking. <laughs> as for the rest of you, no words can describe, and. You know, and, uh, uh, well, you know, so on and so forth, basically. Anyway, that'll go into the next video, which you might be listening to now. We've still got to get through four pictures of three pens, remember? Ah, uh, cool. And I don't mean to insult people that want to learn. Fuck, I can't remember the thing now perfectly, but... What can I? Uh, yeah, you get up to heaven and it's like, uh... Yeah, um, we was ready for the Ofsky and me and the boy was going down into town and fucking you know, <laughs> the Ofsky? I don't know. He understand what he's saying. Man. Like, uh, jokes and that. Mm. Yeah, which I'm quite good at telling apparently, which is a quite, which is a, which 
just a part of my life. It's not about telling jokes and being quite good at it, but you know, it's just a part of my life. You know, there are other aspects of my life uh, which you may or may not be aware of. Uh, you obviously, well, it's more likely that you are, but um, yeah, never mind that for now. Uh, time to get back to trying to get through. What is it? Four pictures of three pounds. That's right. And. Uh, that was the end of uh, four pictures of three pens, and uh, I think I might roll myself a little dacker spliff. Not that I've got a pound of the stuff, but that's fine. That's how it's supposed to be. E mm. There we go. So, uh, oops, I was recording something, and I don't know what I was going to say. And, um, hmm. Is it still recording? Stop the recording. You're now listening to... Fuck, I don't know what I'm... You see how he bigged up the ambulance people and the fire people, but not the police? Well, yeah, for obvious reasons. I also bigged up the, bit, the NHS from what I remember. Uh, hmm. uh. Alright, over here's got the uh, time display, so that helps a bit. Uh, remember for your next updatings, please. Uh, let's just delete him a fast man. You, you, uh, you uh, make it happen with what you have. And, uh, right. Uh, right, will it save not at 480p? What about 360p? Initializing, call cool, in. Yeah. How does some of the IRA sleep behind a door with a reinforced bar? And uh, here's me sitting here with my little screwdriver shank with a fucking door a little girl could fucking kick in, but you know, anyway, so... <laughs> right, and, uh... Oh yeah, and I've got to put a t-shirt at the bottom of the door so it doesn't go clunk, clunk, clunk every time I have a cigarette out of respect for Roger. You know, and, uh, but no, and... Uh, uh, also, I do my fucking head in here, all right, but you know, hey, well... Sorry, I'm waffling on a bit now, but... Uh, that's alright, yo. Um, yeah. Ah, no, like Before I get stopped by the FBI, I'm like, okay, what's going on? <laughs> and I say, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck, now I've got to think about Cash Generators and MC in my board collection, laugh out loud. And, uh... It's nothing illegal, though. I know, I know. And, uh, it was my porn collection, remember? <laughs> Ah, oh, for, oh, for fuck's sake, but how could we not think about that? Oh, oh, they sent my USB off to the fucking Metropolitan Police. No, no, there's nothing illegal there. Do you want it back or what? Oh, yeah, and, uh, <laughs> I think Dylan might have, but, you know, it's not a problem. I did what I could didn't, uh, to get it back, didn't I? Yeah, fucking £60 and fucking... Yeah, then you can have your Xbox. No, 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 you send the Xbox first, then I'll give you the £60. All right, cool. We've sent the Xbox, can we have the £60? No, 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 you've got to send me my USB stick and... Uh, Fuck's sake, never mind again and uh <laughs> Shiza Shitzahausen uh, Wunderbar Well me and Kieran getting the key fob off the African lady and then I'm all upstairs in the night fucking looking for open doors and shit and I fucking find one I'm like right what could I steal there's a projector over there I could look for some money I think I found a bit of cash but I never took it and I was like fuck that I should start fucking throwing these fucking PC towers and shit out the fucking skylight. And then I thought I'd better not, because it might land on fucking Susie's head while she's having a fucking cigarette, you know? Susie, oh, yeah, wake up, Susie. And, uh... Yeah, I'm the founder of the Super Sound Legal Stuff Society, which some people know they're a part of, and, uh... Uh, hmm. And I cannot remember the next important thing to say, but, uh, um, hmm. Smoke a Dacus Cliff and I get real high and I say, hey, what's going on? Hey. But, you know, we're bringing it all back to God and my life's got better since I've learned how to praise him better and, well, you, you well, it just hurts, okay, and, uh, you know, and the other things, ask for forgiveness, the understanding, which you've heard about four times now, and uh, understanding, and 
Alright, uh, mm hmm, mm hmm. We need back to God this time, the other, and fucking okay. Uh, hmm. If I don't put them in, they might never get added, because, uh. Alright, because I've got a saved video and put the marker of what is it? Two pictures of one pen or something, and then anything there is new. Um, Alright, uh. Oh. If I'm trying to unite the Celtic people, not that I'm the only one, but you know, oh yeah, the uh, fucking Irish scarf and the fucking Cumbrian Scotland scarf, and not all about me, but you know, does that make me somehow involved in it all, or sharing all the fucking footage of some of what the IRA did to the fucking UK, or other bits and pieces I've fucking shared, and uh, nah, Britain's a bit great, wonderful people, really, like they, they give you a bit of a hard time sometimes, but they're a lovely bunch, really, and uh, Yeah, so it might be the one next to the, yeah, fucking come and live here for, from 148, 148, one pound, whatever it is, pence, you know, fucking just under a grand and a half, yeah, yeah, come and live here for that amount, and, uh, fucking anyway, though. <laughs> the posh bird going to look at some fucking fancy flats in London, and it's like, oh, there's pubs out the window bit of company at the weekend and uh, <laughs> yeah I has had a bit of experience with that <laughs> we all know that right you know not in a oh man this is, yeah, we all know that right yeah, I lived in Glendale for how many years it was and those fucking pubs all around me and all the lawyers and fucking everything else but you know it's uh I'm glad I went through it somehow but um on charge and roll a tiny duck that's good and say hey what's going on what the video is saving and that but hey something about taking a piss and I'll, I'll just think about something else I want to work for you um well we can get you some job but uh college prospectuses huh okay, uh well, I might not have said her, but in my mind I was like, college prospectus is what the fuck? And then, no, I mean, it just like, yeah. What the fuck? Huh? College prospectives, what the fuck? No. College prospectives. Free training to have good paid job. In town. Oh. Well, it might be good for some people, right? but... What the fuck? <laughs> anyway, I saw them all hugging and shit after I'd said that by their shop. It's like, oh look, you, what do you reckon, Roger? Should we go and get some training? And he's like, ah oh, well, I said, ah oh, well, might be a good idea for some people. And uh, and we come back, they're all like, oh, hey, still, let's hug each other and chip about and stuff, you know? And, yeah. <laughs> That's what I saw, Banjot. Boy, I'm sorry for saying that in this way, I'm not calling anyone a Banjot. This is probably just part of my humour. Um, Well, I could just uh, make a short video after this video, and then put the one pen, t two pictures of one pen marker, and it can be that then a short one. And uh, oh look, there's a bunch of people live. I'm a bit busy at the minute. And hey, yeah, 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 hey. what's going on? Well, if you've been listening to me, you might have a bit of an inkling of what's going on, but well, I'm bragging. Oh, fuck's sake, I'm just talking. You know, that's what I do sometimes. But. All the twos in the time, two, 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 two. So that's, so that's that saving. I've got to go back about four or five videos and then save the draft first and make the new short video. And then that's uh, some more work done in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh yeah, that's something wrong with mine, isn't it? Partly on behalf of our Heavenly Father. Um, the wind said it's perfectly fine to say that, Bill. How's that saving video coming along? 
I even took the cigarette out of my mouth to say it. Not that I haven't sort of mastered the art of having a cigarette in my mouth while you're talking a little bit, but. What's that noise? I don't know. It almost sounds like a. Uh, Anyway, that's enough of that noise, right? And why is it stuck on 4%? That's doing my head in and... Not a problem for me. What do you reckon? Shall I go back and uh, try and edit the video?